I'm Laura Elizabeth, and this is MTV's Cribs on a Quarter, a DIY makeover show for people with a whole lot of taste, but not a lot of cash. Oh god, it's like Dumb and Dumber. Oh god. For just $250, I'm gonna work my DIY magic to turn this boring apartment into a crib you cannot believe. Whoa. Let's get started. I'm outside Zach's apartment. He just moved in with his girlfriend, Danica. They're living together for the first time. They don't have a lot of stuff, but what they do have, I'm pretty sure they found off the street. So let's go see what we're working with. Hi, Hi Zach. Hi. Oh my gosh, who is this? It's little Olive. Hi, Olive. Okay, well, I'm not gonna get too distracted with this cute little puppy because we need to get to work. Well, I mean, there's a lot of everything going on here. Did you get most of this stuff from different places? Mostly the street. That okay. was free on the street. The free schools, on the street? We're free on the free street. Free on the street? All of us free on the street. Free on the street? Free on the street? Free on, free on the street, street, Free street. on the street? Free on Mostly the street. And you live with your girlfriend? Yes. Is she invisible? She's not here. She's at work. She's We're at work? Her. She oh, know. so she doesn't yeah. know that I'm here. She does not know. Is she okay with us redoing the apartment? <laughs> we'll find out. She's kind of picky, so. Really? We'll we'll oh, great. No pressure. <laughs> no pressure. I'm assuming this is Olive's bed? Yes, this is her bedroom. Starting at the rug, so you're actually inside. Oh, sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm inside the bedroom. Now I'm outside. This is your one attempt at separation for the apartment? Yeah. And then so. you have the closet space here. Yeah, she's been wanting to put up curtains or something to add a little okay. privacy. <laughs> I know a thing or two about her and don't worry about it. Do you guys ever have people over? Occasionally. Occasionally. Yeah, so they just have to sit on the bed or. So it's like know, a big slumber party all the time. Yeah. I really do like the space. I just feel like there's not a lot of separation or coziness. So if you have people over, it's like all you have to offer them is a wood floor. Yeah. Everything feels really low, like the art's on the floor. Everything's very low, and yeah. then it's like so bright everywhere mm -hmm. else. So I feel like we need to like liven it up a little bit. She's a very lively person, so well, it doesn't you, really match her. It doesn't match it at all. Mm -hmm. Well, I feel really confident about this. I really like the space, and I'm really excited to surprise your girlfriend. I hope you've been ring shopping, because after this, you got to wife her up. No pressure! Hey! Zach! Yes? Are you ready for a DIY? I'm more than ready. Do you know what DIY stands for? Do it yourself. Actually, it stands for do it your way in my head. No. Because like, I just kind of do whatever I want. What we're gonna be doing is a DIY ombre curtain. Because like we said, you can see your closet. We mm -hmm. want some structure and some spatial privacy. So I got the width of your door and then I went to the hardware store, got a little piece of wood measured and cut for me. What I'm gonna be making the curtain out of is actually, dun da da da, rope. I measured the height of your doorway and pre-cut these, but we wanna make sure that we do a knot at the end so that it doesn't fray, see how it would do that. Like basically it would look like what my hair looks like in the morning if I were to like brush it out. <laughs> this is no pressure. This is like a happen. super big DIY because there's love involved. There is a hand stapler involved. Okay. Which is terrifying for you. Oh! That's very loud. I told you it's intense. I don't know if this is the hard part or if the dying is gonna be the hard part. I think everything is the hard part. Got so, it. So. Last one, here we go. Oh my God! Wow. Ooh, it's heavy. Oh. But look, wow. I can't even see you from here. Can you see me? No. Hello? <laughs> it's like, like some mustard or mayo. Now we're perfectly secure, just like your relationship is about to be after your apartment's redone. Let's take it to the stove to do some dip dyeing. This is a little bit of a hot DIY because we do have hot water. That's what we need for the dye. So first, before you get close, okay. we're gonna pour the first color in. And this is the lightest blue because we're gonna do an ombre. I'm gonna mix it up, ooh, it's hot. Okay, so we're gonna start our soup with 75% of the rope. Look how pretty it looks already. Do you see the blue? Yeah, I really great. like it. Yeah. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna use this at home to kind of roll it around, see if we do like one twist. And then we'll keep it held up for a second while I pour this in. Stir it gonna stir bit. it. Oh, Zach knows. He's telling me what to do now. Whoa. Wow. Yeah. For the final color, the darkest of the darkest blues. Okay. Now, can I take full credit? 100%. Zach, how are you feeling? 
I'm, I'm good, I'm happy. You know what, I love the surprise factor. And even though we're surprising your girlfriend, I still want you to have an element of surprise as well. Right. So go take a break, okay. go walk the dog, and I will see you in a brand new apartment. I know you have a dog in your hand, so we're gonna be okay. safe about this reveal. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Open your eyes. Whoa. So for this table, it's a two-in-one situation mm -hmm. because it's basically an old cabinet and I took the door off and put Olive's bed in here. It fit perfectly. So now not only do you have storage, Olive's stuff is out of the way and you don't even have to worry about it. Remember when no one was allowed on this side because it was yours? Her tail is wagging, which means she's happy, which means she likes it. <laughs> Painted all of your accents blue. As you can see, the table's blue and white, the stools are blue and white, the yeah. bookshelf. She's gonna love the bookshelf. This is your curtain yeah. that Show. you made with your own two hands. <laughs> so I also added a lot of your art. Remember I told you everything was really low because mm -hmm. you didn't have anything hung? Right. So all I did was <laughs> took it up for yeah. you. Do you think that we should show your girlfriend or do you think she's gonna kill me? I think we should show her. Hi, Danica! <laughs> Welcome home! <laughs> Hi, because I just redid your apartment with your boyfriend. Wow. For under $250. <laughs> What's that? Looks glamorous. I know. Something? I love it. Oh my There's God. There's a little light in there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, that looks awesome. Oh, it looks so good. <laughs> okay, bye guys. It was so nice meeting you. Uh, are you taking all of us? What? You got a dog in your hand. Oh no, this is my purse. <laughs> bye. Okay, fine. Bye guys, enjoy your new place. <laughs> Bye. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this episode of MTV's Cribs on a Quarter. I'm Lauren Elizabeth, and I hope you gave this video a thumbs up already. If you didn't, what are you doing? Let's go. Subscribe as well so you know when the next video is live, and I will see you then. Bye, guys.